Ambient temperature is normal. Life support at 100%. I detected yeah, I figure that much. We still have that drive core reading, right? We need to get it back. Enemies! I need to go around. I think that's it. Did they take it to the flop house? We need to get out of this heat zone. above normal temperatures. Yeah, there's like no real short way to get there. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Let's try this Arroyo. out. Heat levels increasing. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Yeah, if you do this long enough, be nice to prep for saying. Ryder, don't forget about that sweet drive core remtech. I'm not. Want to know why I hate the cat? They kill on sight, destroying the Angara, the smell. All of the above. And I know I'm onto something with the remnant. I can feel it. I want to piece it all together, Drac. I have to. But the cat being here, it could ruin everything. Look, I didn't expect such a nasty enemy here either, and I don't have a lot of time. I'll give you the same advice I give myself. What's that? Work faster. Yeah, that's, that's actually... Heat levels increasing. No crap. Going the wrong way. drive along the side of a mountain range, I am going to drive along the side of a mountain range. Okay, fine. Oh, 
remember this place, Paradise Sands, clearly has a sense of humor. What's with the smudge over your eyes? Trying to be some kind of superhero? Why all the bones? Trying to be some kind of supervillain? Yes. Cool. Yeah, we are back in the freaking... If this is the every criminal for herself kind of place, we better keep our heads down. You ever hear the saying, honor among thieves? People say that? Still? Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. It's interesting doing this quest after having cleaned out the flop house. I should equip the backup life support while I was out. Temperature levels are climbing, Pathfinder. I know. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. We need to get out of this heat zone. is is over this way heat levels increasing wow we fit I don't think we'll last much longer in this temperature levels are climbing Pathfinder Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. The one part of over here we didn't and we didn't check. Well then, let's say hi. I have my new sniper rifle. Dude, it does. Answer, it removes heads really well. That's the last of 
them. Let's find that drive core. Oh, not bad. I need to upgrade my assault rifle. Sure for what? Track? Any ideas? A few clan Jorgal is the worst, unbalanced, unreliable. Did they just sell it on Kadara, but then why hide it here? I don't know, but I can't wait to I I, it's like, I don't like it. I, the explanation I'm getting is gonna be really good, but I don't like what I'm gonna hear. This is serious. Political double crosses involving enormous bombs. <laughs> Track, do me a favor and don't spill this to the Krogan yet. I want to talk to Morda and Strux face to face. You got it. <laughs> Gil, I need you to send an ops crew to this location. They're picking up a remnant drive core. Got it. Will do. Sam, change the passcode on the door to this place and transmit it to Gil. Keep that tech safe. It might be the most powerful thing we've found. We just... Picked up amazing rem tech, but all I can think about is a shower. Waste of water. What you need is a good old-fashioned Krogan dust bath. <laughs> like, th like, this is actually a really big deal, having a, a remnant drive core to examine. That is, like... Yeah. Here is the important question. If I walk out this door, will Strux be waiting for me? Seriously, password one, two, three. Who uses that as their password? That is like the least insecure password in the history of password protection. So next destination is we're heading back to New Tuchanka. Where we will say hi to Morda, and and like, hey, Strux was going to build a giant bomb using the Crive Core. And the possibilities he are trying to utterly destroy the Nexus, or as a remnant, or as a big power play. A big, super stupid power play. <laughs> but those scavengers are roasting. I saw the worm out there again. That thing is huge. Bigger than a thresh maw, isn't it? Make a good ride of passage. We ought to check it out, actually. See if we can get in on the action. Soft, squishy human like you should probably steer clear of the wildlife out there. You said something about a worm. Not a worm. The worm. Huge. Invincible. You can't miss it. It pops out of the dunes from time to time. Plows down everything in its path. We... As if this planet wasn't deadly enough. Good news is, it doesn't attack us. It doesn't seem to care about us at all. Just stay out of its way. It'll barrel right through you, tear you to pieces. Thanks for the heads up. Let's say hi. Hello, Nexus. 
You're back. I am. Strux tells me you went to get the drive core from my remnant ship. That's true. And that you sold it to scavengers who took it off world to make a profit. For you and them? It was gone when I got there. Not possible. I had blasting teams there day and night. Clan Nakmore is a joke. The losers of Chichanka and now the losers of Helios. Overlord Morda has lost the Drive Corps and our colony is doomed. You're all talk, Jorgal Strux. I made this colony. If there's an Overlord, they should be... Aha! Uh -huh. This, blood this explains Jorgal. it. Watch. I'll rescue the Drive Corps and make us so powerful that the Nexus will bow down to us. Except you can't, because we have it. Oh, Drac. I wanted to see how long before you <laughs> What do you mean you have it? I'll let the Pathfinder answer. <sighs> I'm gonna be kind of smarty, smart alky here. Strux played us both. Told me you were building a bomb. Told me you were planning an attack on the colony. I'm impressed, Strux. You're more cunning than most Clan Jorgal. Smarter, even. Not more arrogance. My father lowered himself to join your clan because he admired your grandfather. He was laughed at, called not worth killing. But now I've bested you, Morda, and Clan Nakmore will pay with no, blood. You... you put the colony at risk over a grudge you carried across dark space? You really aren't worth killing, Jorgal Strux. Get out. Take your goons with you. Now where is the drive core? Hand it over. Just like that. Hand it over? It's incredibly powerful. We'll use it to power the colony. This'll put us ahead by decades. Ryder, that's unique remnant tech. If you keep that drive core, it's over between the oh, and shit. the Nexus forever. You have to give us something for it. It's only right. We did get shot at. A lot. What about joining our colony with your outpost? Give us the drive core and we'll be friends. New Tachanka and Nexus. Keep it, and you've created a sovereign Krogan nation. We don't abide by Nexus laws or owe you anything. Even peace. Ryder, I must point out that historically, unchecked Krogan advancement has been the cause of war and disaster for many, even the Krogan. Well? Okay, so here's how I want to play this. It's not really giving us the option, but here's how I want to play this. Um, Krogan get the drive core. Nexus scientists, EB, get to help study the drive core because this is tech we don't know and don't fully understand, but we do know that if it goes unstable and goes out of control, it will draw the scourge to this planet and make what is already a hellhole into something far more terror, into something far, far worse. And play, and so, what I want to do is this option. We get to study it, and we get to help you keep it operational. I don't know if the, if we get to add those conditions with this option, but this is what I want to pick. Okay, Morda. Let's work together. You can have the Remnant Drive Core. And you can set up your outpost here, Nexus. We're all going to be friends and prosper, right? You bet we are. Whenever you're ready, bring your outpost people here, and they'll be welcome. This is a great day, Morda. We'll contact Addison and give her the news. Good luck, Overlord Morda. <sighs> Pathfinder. This location is ideal for outpost placement. You can call an outpost via the beacon. Okay.
Been out of the sea of Ataraxia? I'm looking pretty wild out there. Alright, let's so we have side quest stuff up here. One more new side quest. Ah, shop. We're closing early tomorrow. Any reason? Pathfinder, welcome. We don't welcome an alien into our colony, you ignorant child. Shut up, old man. Sorry about that. Don't mind him. Credits are credits, I say. About time someone around here is friendly. Just give him time. I have done that. Once. Now buy something before he starts yelling again. Sell all salvage. Buy items. No new stuff for the nomad. Hmm. Melee! Krogan Hammer! That's not really my style, though. And... Shotguns, the Venom 5. That is the Solarian! Shotgun. Actually, one thing I'm going to just sell. Uh... Like that. Some of the lower grade mods. I want a level five, three, uh, four version of the Karafion because I like sword design. I like that it heals. It is really nice having a weapon that heals me. So, Tableland, let's get the vault. <laughs>